And here is 21WA. There is a bunch of new changes like to world generation, copper, changes to mob spawning, and uh, some biome changes. So uh, let's get into it. And starting off with the world generation. Now world generation has been changed a little bit and the first one has to do with mining. If you mine deeper down you will actually get more ores to make it more rewarding to actually mine deeper. As you can see we can see a bunch of more ores around near the depths. Another change is that non-cave biomes no longer change with height. And the next change will be to biomes. Now biomes will actually match closer to the size in 1.17 but be slightly bigger than them. And the next change will be to villages. Now villages will actually be more spread out than they are currently in the past snapshots. As you can see there's a village here but there won't be another village for quite a while. But now going into the water magma blocks will actually spawn much more often. And also, uh, gravel will now spawn below Y level 0, as you can see there are some right over here. And dungeons will spawn more frequently below Y level 0 as well. And lastly, here is the ore distribution chart that has been changed. Look up on screen right now and pause it if you want to see it more frequently. Now on to mod spawning. Now axolotls will only spawn in waters above clay blocks in lush caves. The next part is glow squids will actually only spawn in water blocks under height level 30. So you're gonna need to go under Y level 30 within these new snapshots to actually find these glow squids. Cod, salmon, pufferfish, tropical fish, squids, and dolphins now only spawn between the heights of 50 to 64. Some copper changes have been added. First, in the stone cutter, a block of copper can be converted into four cut copper. As you can see, you can get four cut copper for just one simple block of copper. The next change is with the copper ore. Copper ore now drops two to five instead of two to three raw copper. As you can see, now we got five from just one piece of copper when we used to actually almost get a maximum of three. So this is a very good change for people who want more copper. Tropical fish also spawn in lush caves at any height. So you can also find these tropical fish in lush caves now, which is very cool. Zombies also once again spawn in drifton caves and drowns can also spawn there. And goats no longer spawn in stony peaks. There was some optimized AI for Axolotls, Goats, Hoglins, Zoglins, Piglins, Piglin Brutes, and Villagers. Bedrock layers also generate dependent on world seed now. And there were some bugs that were obviously fixed like performance issues and stuff like that. But I won't bore you guys with that stuff. And that is basically it for all of the changes. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll be doing this for every snapshot. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and leave a like and comment if you really did. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.